Hello everyone. In this video session, I am going to explain part 103 of Java for Tester series. That is split method of string class. String class, string class in Java has different methods. String class in Java has different predefined methods, guys, and the split method is one of them. Split method is one of the methods, predefined methods of the string class in Java. So what is the purpose of using the split method? Using split method, we can split the text into different parts, okay? Using the split method, we can split the text, given text into different parts okay we can split the text given text into different parts single given text into multiple different parts we can split into based on based on some space or some symbol etc guys okay so let me show you one thing like for example if i have something like this qfox.com okay the let me give something like this this is an example guys uh, kfox.com the software testing tutorials like this if i give something like this okay so this is a string literal text and if i use apply the split method and if i input the space for the split method the split method will divide this uh, single string literal text into multiple parts based on the space so if the split method comes across any space it will break this uh, single statement into multiple parts like qfox.com space is there so it will split qfox.com then the is there the after the another space it will split the the okay it will uh, break uh, it will it will make this die into separate part like software testing all the spaces will be considered by the split method and this uh, single string literal text will be break into one two three four five okay using the spaces it will break this single statement into multiple parts like first part, second part, third part, fourth part, fifth part, like that. And then there will be some situations where you will be using some symbols between the text. Like for example, if I use something like this, qfox.com hyphen, the hyphen, okay, software hyphen, testing hyphen, tutorials, let's say, something like this if I use, okay. And if I use the split method, and uh, I will input this hyphen symbol to the split method so that uh, using this hyphen symbol, the split method will break this single sing string literal statement into multiple parts like qfox.com hyphen is there, it will split, okay? It will break here and the is there, again it will break. So multiple parts we can break using the symbol. It may not be hyphen symbol by guys, it can be any symbol, it can be dollar symbol, it can be hash symbol, anything. You just need to input that symbol to the split method so that it can split this, uh, single statement into multiple parts okay so split method of string class splits the text into different parts based on the provided text symbol or space okay even using text also it can split okay using the given text symbol or space we can split the provided text into different parts okay so let me practically demonstrate okay let me practically demonstrate how to use the split method of uh, string class in java to split this uh, single uh, string literal text into multiple parts based on the given text symbol or spaces okay let me show you that so let's create a string literal for that i will create a variable and declare that with string class and assign some string literal text to this particular variable uh, let's take the same thing like qfox.com the software testing tutorials okay like this and followed by I will use the split method now, guys. Uh, I will say a dot split. Okay. You see a dot split. This is this is the one you have to take, guys. Okay. So a dot split, uh, and you have to give the argument that you want to use for splitting. For example, I want to use space. For that, I have to provide double quotes, and I have to provide a single space. Just provide a single space this uh, in between these double quotes. Okay. I have using this split method. I have inputted the single space so that uh, you, this split will 
break this string literal text stored at variable a into multiple parts using the single space okay so when the split uh, method comes across any space it will break this statement okay into different parts so fine uh, a dot split will happen but what is the return type of the split method the split method is re returning you string of array okay string of array that means the single string literal text will be break into multiple strings that's why we have to store this return type into string of array okay string of uh, array let's say b is equal to okay like this so the single string got uh, break into multiple strings and that is getting stored into the variable b which is declared of single dimensional string okay data type array fine single dimensional string array it is got stored into now how to print all these things we'll use some for loop or for each loop guys for okay for each and every uh, part of this uh, array will be a string literal so it will be string temp colon b you have to pass b here okay this is how we have to use for each loop i have explained about arrays and uh, for each loop in the previous video, one of the previous videos guys uh, just go back to the previous videos so if you don't have any idea of how to use arrays or uh, for each loop okay i am not going to explain again so in one of the previous few of, in few of the previous videos i explained i covered all these things okay fine anyhow let's get to the thing for string temp colon b system dot out dot print ln temp okay if i say something like this and if i run this right click run as java application you see the single string literal text pfox.com the software testing tutorials based on the provided space got break into multiple parts pfox.com space has come it breaked pfox.com then da has come after the again space has come it has break the da into separate part then software has come software has been printed then again space has come so it has breaked again testing has come then space it has break the testing then tutorials final word no need to break also okay so like this uh, different uh, the single literal test got uh, break into different parts okay like this uh, we can use the split method guys and another example i will provide you in this is uh, if i replace this space with uh, some hyphen symbol here okay wherever the space is there i am just putting the hyphen symbol uh, to see whether uh, the same we can do the same splitting with the symbol okay by inputting the symbol so a dot split here instead of space i will give i iphone guys okay in, in the double quotes i have to put the iphone symbol here instead of space now a dot split uh, using iphone symbol will happen the same thing will happen guys all the this particular text will be single literal text will be splitted using this high wherever this uh, split method comes across this iphone symbol it will split the text into multiple parts and assign it to the variable of single dimensional string array okay then we can use the for each loop to get uh, all this uh, different parts to be printed fine let's run this and see whether we are getting the same output uh, this time we are using the this thing okay you see we got the same output guys so guys uh, another thing we can do now is like uh, i'll remove this uh, hyphen signs okay i will remove this hyphens for now and uh, what i am going to do is like uh, i am going to give something like this okay the easiest tutorials i am extending the text okay so there is a reason why i am extending the text here i want these two das to be there okay the first the second the so here instead of these things i will give the okay using the text i want to split this okay so what happens uh, how this split method is going to split this string literal text now using the da it has to text wherever the split methods comes across this da text it has to split so here pfox.com space then da has come so it has to split up to here okay and again from da it will go till this part okay till then there is no da again it will split here okay because da has come again this part will be so three parts has to be printed first part is this one second part is from this da to this da okay this da will not be printed in the second part but it starts with the da and then up to tutorials it will be printed then the third part is since the da has been encountered split method will split here this third part is this one has to be printed let's see whether that is happening or not right click run as java application you see qfox.com space then 
okay die is not being printed but uh, it has been used as splitting part okay for splitting purpose it has been used so the remaining thing is like similar to the hyphen guys hyphen didn't get printed in the output right same thing here da will be used only for splitting it will not be printed so here up to software testing tutorials will be printed here along with the spaces you see some spaces are all are there before the okay after after this da there is some space so it is printing up to here okay the uh, up to here i guess okay uh, along with the so uh, along with space okay so then again the has come it has used this the for splitting purpose so again after the there is some space and up to here it will print okay space easiest tutorials like this guys using the text also we can split the text into different parts so this how guys we have to use split uh, method of string class in java for splitting the text using the uh, either using the by using the given uh, space or symbol or text okay we can split the single string literal text into multiple parts uh, by using the split method using this its input uh, text or symbol or space okay so that's it guys uh, in the next video session i'll explain about the next method that is concat concat method of string class in java so that's it guys see you in the next video session thank you bye